1946, Clyde Holliday, an engineer working on the V2 program, modified a 35mm movie camera to withstand the shock of the launch and the impact when it came back to Earth. On October 24, 1946, the camera, which used Eastman Kodak Super XX film running at 4 frames per second, was mounted into an aluminium case with 10mm thick walls and into the body of a V2 rocket, and then launched to a height of 107 kilometers. This was the first time that anyone had seen the Earth from the edge of space. From here, they could clearly see 1,200 kilometers in all directions, an area of the equivalent of 4.1 million square kilometers, and they could clearly see the curvature of the Earth.